Justice League plot and story details. The closing scenes of Batman v Superman, you may remember, saw the Man of Steel celebrated posthumously as a hero, with Bruce Wayne vowing to assemble the Justice League to avenge Superman's death and protect the world from the various threats that loom, some more extraterrestrial than Lex Luthor. The Justice League plot continues more or less directly on from there. Here's the official, spoiler-free plot synopsis courtesy of DC. Fooled by his restored faith in humanity and inspired by Superman's selfless act, Bruce Wayne enlists the help of his newfound ally, Diana Prince, to face an even greater enemy. Together, Batman and Wonder Woman work quickly to find and recruit a team of meta-humans to stand against this newly awakened threat. But despite the formation of this unprecedented League of Heroes, Batman, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, Cyborg and The Flash, it may already be too late to save the planet from an assault of catastrophic proportions. That synopsis, together with one of the scenes from the Comic Con trailer, seems to hint at a fun relationship between Bruce and Diana, which shouldn't be too much of a surprise considering the strong chemistry they shared in Dawn of Justice. What could the assault of catastrophic proportions be? Well, it's probably safe to imagine it has something to do with Darkseid, whose Omega symbol cryptically appeared in Bruce Wayne's nightmare in the aforementioned movie, and whose deputy general, Steppenwolf, was contacted by Lex Luthor on board the Krypton ship. In other words, some all-powerful threat seems guaranteed to descend from a distant planet to create hell for the Justice League. That's precisely the kind of high-stakes villainy a movie like Justice League calls for. Justice League Theories Nobody enjoys a good fan theory quite like superhero fanboys and girls, as evidenced by the absolute meteor shower of speculation to hit the internet in the months leading up to Batman v Superman and Suicide Squad. Currently, with not much revealed in the way of story, Justice League Theories are pretty thin and far between right now. Expect that to change in 2017 with the release of more trailers. It's worth questioning exactly what Lex Luthor will be getting up to in the movie, though, check out this theory involving the mystery of Lex Sr. single quote s death. Will we visit Krypton? One thing we know for sure, based on various reports from set visits in June, is that the Justice League will visit both the Masira and Atlantis in search of two Mother boxes hidden centuries ago. The third is hiding in plain sight having created Cyborg. Wouldn't it also make sense to visit Superman's home planet? It could be that the only way the Man of Steel can be returned to full strength upon his resurrection is a flying visit to Krypton. All of the other theories we've heard so far also revolve around Superman, the method of his resurrection and the reason he'll be suiting up in a black costume. Check out three of the best. Every new theory to hit the internet will be added here, just as long as it's not totally insane. Jason Todd theorists, I'm looking at you. Justice League spoilers. Beyond the vague hints given by Zack Snyder and members of the cast so far, Justice League spoilers are almost non-existent right now. Filming is done and trailers are being cut, though, so it shouldn't be long before spoilers begin to leak on the internet. We'll post the more reliable sounding ones right here in due course.